love it. I love it. Ladies and gentlemen, we've got 100 Gex on the show with us joining us. What is good? We've got Dylan and Laura. I am Hanuman. It's very nice to meet you guys for the first time. Nice to meet you as well. Hello. Yes, sir. First, I got to say congratulations. Uh, two months sold out North American shows. Um, how does it feel to kind of be able to... Kind of. <laughs> kind of. Ki ki you know what? You know what? We're just going to fudge We're just gonna fudge it for television. We're just going to pretend that it is, you know, we're just not going to get into the I details. I love to pretend. I love, I love to, to pretend. <laughs> yeah, we just 100% sold out the entire... Uh, North American tour. Yep. Only one show didn't. See, you're splitting the hairs at that point. How does it feel for you guys to kind of take a knee after all of that? I know that uh, the road can be unforgiving. How does it feel to finally get some downtime before Europe is very quickly approaching? Feels amazing. It's not all downtime. I mean, we're here. So. Yeah, yeah, fair enough. I got to ask, you know, I've been spending a lot of time with the last record. I know it's been a couple months since it came out, but I feel like you guys do this very sincere thing where you're pulling from different genres and different influences and kind of putting them all together. And I really feel the thing that stuck out most for me is how sort of respectful you guys are of, of a genre that might have once been maligned. And I'm kind of talking about ska at this point. Do you feel like we're primed for like a ska revival? Yeah. Long overdue? Yeah. I mean, I don't know. People should just make more good ska. It seems like it's it's a... It's odd that it seems mis misaligned or whatever. It's like, it's so good. It's so fun. Absolutely. I mean, do you think it was just sort of a, uh, I don't know, mass saturation point in the 90s that kind of happened and the people kind of turned their backs on it? I wouldn't know. I was only uh, <laughs> uh, six when the 90s ended, so. <laughs> Um, well, I gotta ask you guys, we're sitting at the very top of your All Control playlist uh, this week, and we're talking about Hollywood Baby. I mean, where were you guys in the lab when this all kind of began to take shape? L.A. It, it was many different iterations of that song, so it's kind of been a journey on that one. Mm -hmm. I mean, how many versions are we talking here before we got to the one that we got on the album? I'd say like seven, <laughs> probably eight. <laughs> I yeah, probably gotta, eight gotta open up the project folder we have like a bunch of like alternative versions of each song what you coming back baby are you getting lazy clear blue sky but it rains all the late fees did you get the payment we had an arrangement we don't want to watch the news we just read statements. yeah do you want like a deluxe or something like that no they're worse <laughs> i mean the one that the one that ended up is better <laughs> fair enough fair enough <laughs> i want to ask you guys talked about like you know how many iterations hollywood baby took before it kind of landed on the album did you guys leave a lot of stuff on the sort of the cutting room floor to go into the next project i know Ten Thousand already came out in may but like how much of that stuff didn't make it onto the project and is that sort of something fans are going to be able to hear in the future Probably not. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, they can hear it on A. You can hear it at the live show. Uh, if you, I, well, I mean, you could have heard it. You can maybe hear it in the future. You know, we got a couple songs that we didn't use for that, that we played in the live show. So, yeah. you know, stuff like that. But yeah, I don't know. I mean, we chose the best stuff, I feel like. We got we got all the best bits of uh, what we've been working on, and it's all on the album, and you can listen to it today on Apple Music. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Now in spatial audio. Now it's now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I, unfortunately for me, they have my passport. I can't leave the country until I mention spatial audio. So thank you for doing that for me. I no appreciate problem. that. I appreciate no that. problems. Well, guys, I want to say thank you for taking a couple minutes out of your morning. Uh, I just were huge fans of the project, and um, thanks so much. Thank you guys yeah. again, and uh, thanks for having us. Absolutely, you guys take it easy and appreciate the time. See you later. Bye. Are you looking down the mountain? What you crying about? Crying about? Crying about now? Do you buckle under pressure?
You'll never make it in Hollywood, baby You'll never make it in Hollywood